Good morning, day 61. Um, seven o'clock start time this morning. I'm gonna try to do 16, eight today. We'll see. Um, my body lets me do it. A lot of depends on the terrain too. It's just, this whole section just puds big time. Um, all day it's just pud, 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 pud. So it definitely uh, cuts into the mileage. Um, so if I do the 16.8, that'll put me at the state park, which is two miles outside of Rutland. I haven't figured out to spend the night there. I can take a shower there. And then the next day I can just go into Rutland and uh, maybe change. So if I go into Rutland, um, not, uh, yeah, it would be tomorrow. Just a little Nero into Rutland. Uh, I would have to probably do laundry and then just get a resupply and, uh, and then go back out the same day. So it wouldn't technically be in Nero probably that day. But the other option is, is I wanted to, it would have been nice to just get a hotel um, in Rutland, spend the night, do the laundry, next day, you know, just get the resupply or whatever and get out. That way I can get a nice, you know, nice shower, nice, everything's just easier. But that's like 18 miles today and I don't think I have it in me to do it. Um, especially if you get there late, you get there late, then it's kind of useless to get a hotel because you, uh, got to check out like, you know, 10, 11 or something like that. But I haven't figured it out yet. I really should have did more miles yesterday. Um, that way I could have got to Rutland today, but there's just no good place to get water. A lot of people carried it up to the tower, the lookout up here. I'm about to get to in probably another half hour. And uh, I wasn't willing to do it. I wanted to have the water right there. So, yeah. I mean, this is all minor details, I guess. None of this stuff really matters at the end. Um, I don't stay in a hotel, I don't stay in a hotel. It's fine. So, about four of us at the campsite last night or the uh, shelter uh, two no bowers and two so bowers one of them was me um, so this morning uh, pretty much just uh, got up six ish uh, and uh, I think I was out of out of there by seven a little before seven and the other guy the Nobor across, like, from me, is like, I'm going to get up at five, you know, he's telling his friend or whatever, I'm going to get up at five. And then I left before he did. It's like, I don't understand why he get up at five and just diddly-daddly around for two hours. I don't get it. I really don't. Uh, it took me 45 minutes to get up, get everything done, eat, shit shower and shave. And then I was out. If I didn't have to crap, I'd have been out even sooner, you know? So, um, I don't, yeah, I just don't get the whole take two hours and, you know, I, and I beat you out, you know? I could have had an extra hour of sleep if he just got up at six, you know? But I gotta pass the bubble. Once I pass the bubble, and then, uh, should be like just in the sobers and you can really plan your stays and be all spread out and all that so it won't be as packed at all the shelters but all right um i'm gonna make some time here because this is a little bit of an uphill and get the four-wheel drive out all right y'all see you soon have you ever seen a tree grow like this and it's alive it's not like it's not alive. That's so weird. Huh. 
This is a first. <laughs> I think it's funny, actually. Well, we can't get up this rock without the ladder? <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, a little boardwalk. Let me tighten this phone up here. There we go. Like another 2.3 miles to my destination for today. Uh, I'll make it like 16, I think, some 16.8 or something like that today. Um, I did take two ibuprofen today. I could not get through the day without it. Um, it sucks, but... Uh, it's just different type of terrain the last three days and my body's not used to it and it's panicking or I don't know what is going on. It's just about seven miles in. It's just like everything's hurting on uh, my feet wise. Uh, so I took some ibuprofen and uh, was able to get through the rest of the day. But hopefully, uh, you know, the body will adjust and I won't have to take the ibuprofen. Uh, I'm probably gonna have to take it one or two or three more times. I don't know. We'll see. Hopefully not, but just have to keep adjusting. Like it did in the last 400 miles, I didn't have to take it for for quite a while, so body adjusted. But this is a different type of terrain. I'm doing more miles. It doesn't seem to be miles related though, because I did what 12 yesterday. I didn't need any ibuprofen. So, today after seven miles, it started hurting. So, it's just different type of terrain. But, uh, we'll see. All right, I'm gonna put the camera away, get some people up here. Private lake, I don't know. I don't know what lake this is, I have to look. But, it's like I'm walking through somebody's backyard or something. It's funny. Some of this property I walk on, it's like, am I allowed to be here? You know? So, hiker supplies, 10 minutes, follow BCO signs. Uh, Springer, uh, 1,680 miles. Uh, mountain meadows. All right, decided not to stay at the state park. The inn here had one room available another mile on the AT so I did like 17 something today possibly even 18 but uh it was a blue blaze over here it's a pretty tough blue blaze too but I'm here I'm um, gonna get checked in and they have a pub here an Irish pub so I'm gonna get some bratwurst and whatever else so I'm gonna get checked in Wherever the entrance is. Yeah. There we go. That's where I'm staying. Hey y'all. <clears throat> Just uh, had dinner. I'm in my room here. Had a Caesar salad with chicken. And also had a Reuben. Destroyed it all. <laughs> so... Um, just had a lower bar as well. Got some other stuff. Maybe I'll have another bar tonight as well. Um, just chilling like a villain. Um, my laundry is drying right now. I already took a shower. So tomorrow I'm going to take a bus into town, go to Walmart, get a resupply going on, and then I'll, uh, hope to get back about 11 12 ish maybe a little earlier and then go out and uh try to do like 10 ish miles maybe we'll see um so i did 18 miles today officially on the at although i had the blue blaze i probably blue blazed another mile today so almost an 18 mile today 
like I said, I had to take some ibuprofen about seven miles in. It's different type of terrain, and it's just wreaking havoc with my feet. But uh, I'm hoping my feet can learn and adjust. Well, I don't have to take the ibuprofen, but I don't know. We'll see. Um, everybody knows me. I don't like taking ibuprofen. I feel like it does long-term damage to the body, so... But, uh, the ibuprofen got me through the day. I took it, you know, like 11 or something like that. So I was able to do hike until like almost, almost 6. I think it was like 5.30 or something by the time I got here. Um, so, yeah. I'm uploading some videos and just getting some things done. Cleaning out my bag and rid of all the trash and then, uh just uh charging up my batteries and whatnot so i'm gonna go ahead and edit this video and get this one uploaded as well so we'll see you tomorrow oh yeah i got breakfast included to, so i don't know it's supposed to be uh it's supposed to be pretty good so we'll see hot breakfast tomorrow all right we'll see you soon all right bye